But guys, imagine this. Everything around us right now is palm oil plantations. Adventure for the news. <laughs> This is a decent road. Come on, bridge, hold, hold, hold. Yes. I cannot believe it. This is the most beautiful experience I've had in Kalimantan yet. What's up, you guys, and welcome back to the channel. My name is Christian Hansen. In this episode, I'm in Simetau. So I'm still in Western Kalimantan and I've stayed here for one night in the supposedly best hotel they have here in the city. And uh, the guys out front, well, they were super nice. They helped me out with everything. The electricity went out for a couple of hours during the night. So yeah, it was hard to sleep. It was very, very hot. And this morning I'm super excited because we will be crossing the Kapuas River for the first time, putting Machan on a small canoe kind of boat and we will start going deep into the Sawit, the palm oil plantations because this is a shortcut if you want to get from Simitao up to the border then you can cross the river go through the plantations for like three or four hours on dirt roads because if you go the other way then I would have to drive eight or nine hours if I go through the cities so I just sent the drone out and this way I could kind of see the roads that I will be driving on today and it looks rough. I couldn't see any other cars. I could just see these red dirt roads and plenty of palm oil plantations. So I'm excited to say that this is going to be the first proper test for Machan for my new KTM 790 Adventure Rally. So uh, wish me luck guys and let's get back on the road. All right guys, so I'm filling up. Hi. <laughs> I'm filling up Machan full now with Pertalite for the first time. It's 13,000 per liter. But luckily, the benefit of riding on Machan versus Turanga is that Machan has six liters more in the tank than Turanga did. So, um, yeah, that will keep me going for quite a bit longer until I get to another gas station again. To be honest with you, I have no idea where to get this boat across the river right now. Um, I guess I will just have to, you know, ride around and see if I can find one. Hello. <laughs> Hanya mau ke ke sana. Iya, pakai lewat sawit dengan ini. Bisa call, Captain. Saya bisa bayar ekstra gak apa-apa. Tapi saya mau ke sana sekarang. Bisa? Oke. Oke, okay. okay, makasih ya, Bu. Boleh foto? Boleh, boleh, boleh. Oke. Okay. Oke. Okay. Ini. Okay guys, we're allowed to get some help because I cannot afford this boat alone. Hello. Okay guys. Yeah, <laughs> Okay. Okay, okay push. Okay. Huh? Oh. <laughs> oh guys, I almost dropped my phone in the in the river. 
Whew. All right, we made it. Machan almost tilted over and I almost dropped my phone in the river, but besides that, all is good. Dada de! Sampai ketemu lagi ya. <laughs> oh, too cute. Oh, makasih ya, bro. <laughs> All right, guys. Let's go to the palm oil plantation. A lot of things could have gone wrong right about there, but it didn't. Oh, it's been my dream to have Machan on a boat on a river in Galiman, and now we're doing it. All right, guys, that took about four minutes to get over here, but uh, I don't know. I have a bad feeling about this. Okay, no problem. Lurus aja? Ah, lurus aja. Okay. Nanya nanya semua orang jadi jalannya nanti. Okay. Nanya nanya semua orang. Okay, okay. Terima ya, guys. Machan, take a good look Look at this road. You guys from here, it's gonna be adventure to the woods. <laughs> All right, guys. I have now taken out a good part of the air out of my tires. Back tires are 25 PSI because I got quite a lot of luggage. And the front tires are 22. We are now in off-road mode here on Machan both the ABS and the ride mode and uh, yeah wish me luck let's go Lurus aja ya? Iya. Dari mana? Dari Denmark, Bu. Waduh. Yeah. Feeling Indonesia. Belanda. It's good Indonesia. It's the best. Paling negara di dunia, Pak. Paling very, very nice. Very very nice. Very very nice. Very, 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 very. <laughs> oh, jalan jalan oke okay, ya? Aman okay. dari sini ke ya. Yeah. Yeah. Tiga jam ya? Sir. Yo. Oh, udah makan, Pak. Udah, udah, udah. Makasih ya. Oke, okay, see you guys. just 15 minutes of riding without any road signs or any signal I was completely lost Fuck, it's hot I'm getting chills <sighs> but it definitely looks like I'm driving the wrong way <coughs> mm, oh, wild dogs so cute but they're definitely not used to talking to humans hi mm, oh. <laughs> So cute. Can I take you with me on my trip? Oh, there's a truck. Follow the truck. Okay. All right. Let's follow the truck. Come on, bridge. Hold, hold, hold. Yes. No problem. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Malaysia, kiri, ha? Kiri, lurus aja. Okay, makasih ya. Oh okay, guys, let's go. Wow, okay. This is a decent.
Mason Road. No problem. Oh my god, this is awesome. Nothing but a dirt road ahead of us. Good times and potentially a heat stroke. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This road is actually now a lot easier than I would have expected. But guys, imagine this. Everything around us right now is palm oil plantations. All of this used to be natural deep forest. And it's been cleared, all of it, just to make palm oil so that we can use palm oil in shampoo, Nutella, a ton of candy, chocolates, candles. Isn't it crazy to think about? As far as my eye can see right now, it's just palm oil trees. I haven't been inside of a plantation like this before, like deep in. It kind of put things into perspective a little bit, you know? If there's one thing I really appreciate during these kind of journeys, it's simply remembering to stop and to be grateful for where I am and for the things I get to see. And I was not alone because shortly after I ran into some other field workers. Badao, they got border, yeah? Malaysia, Indonesia. Badao. Badao. Masih jauh, yeah? Tinggal di sini karena mau cari rupiah. Cari rupiah ya. Asli dari mana? Jawa. Eh, orang Jawa? Iya, orang Jawa. Matur sun. Matur sun. Sami sami. Oh, bisa bos ya. Kalian lihat ular di sini setiap hari? Ya. Di sini sih kebanyakan kobra tuh. Oh, kobra ya? Iya. Bahaya kan? Bisa. Ini ada Christian. Nama saya Arya Christian. Ah, oh, saya juga. <laughs> Mantap. Arya Christian. Oke, okay, guys. Terima kasih ya. Nanti bisa lihat dalam YouTube channel saya. Oke. Okay. Okay? <laughs> Guys, these farming areas, they are so big. I keep passing schools and even churches because there are so many people working in the palm oil plantations that it doesn't make sense for them to drive so long to go to work every day. So they've simply created just small villages out here in these palm oil plantations. There's a lot of trucks here. Alright. Oh, guys, I have made it to supposedly a small village here. And they say I have around one and a half hours left on the on the non-asphalt road. Oh yeah, and there's a lot of dogs here and uh, I asked them why that is and they say it's because the majority of the people living here are Catholics, not Muslim. That's why. Hello guys, hello, hello. <laughs> hello guys. Oh, I love this. Makes me feel like I'm in a completely different world. And I then saw something I have never seen before out here in Indonesia. So I turned the bike around. Let's go and say hi. Hello, De. Dari mana? Asal sini? Orang Indonesia? Iya. Tapi... Mama tuh. Tapi putih. Turunan... Mama? Turunan itu. Turunan barat juga. Oh ya? Yeah? Iya. Yeah. Siapa namanya, Dek? Apa? Elvi. Elvi. Salam kenal saya Chris. Oh. <laughs> Elvi. Oh, Mana? Maaf, uh, enggak pakai baju ya. Mau Bu <laughs> keliling Indonesia dari Sabang sampai Merauke. Oh. Enggak bisa bahasa Indonesia. Iya, <laughs> yeah, masih belajar. Dikit-dikit. Dikit-dikit. Iya. Yeah. Yeah.
Ya. Boleh ke sini? Oh, naik, naik. Oh. oh, burung. Iya. boleh. Halo, Dek. Hmm. Nah. Saya pikir kamu cantik sekali. Iya. Iya, yeah. memang. Elvi mirip keponakan saya. Oh, yeah. Sebentar ya, saya ada foto. Iya, yeah, iya, yeah. bol. Now I want to show her picture of Elvira, my niece. <laughs> ini, ini keponakan saya. Ah, ya, kira punya. Duduk loh. Mana no, kemalau? Namanya Elvira. Ah. Elvira. So guys, my plan was actually to keep going uh, because I still have two hours to get to Badao. But uh, yeah, they invited me in for coffee, so we're just sitting here chatting a bit. Sometimes you have to remember also just to you know, yeah, just relax and be in the moment, you know. So. Ngopi ya? Iya. Iya. Terima kasih ya. Iya. Iya. Tos. Iya. Elvi tahu dari Sabang sampai Merauke. Itu baru dikit-dikit. Dikit-dikit. That girl Elvi, you know, she really touched my heart. You could tell that when her friends came over from the school, you know, she was very shy. I can imagine how difficult in a place like this it must be for her to be so different looking from the others, you know? So that's why I spent quite a lot of time with her and the family. Alright guys, I have made way too many stops today. It's now 5 o'clock, it's about to get dark and I've only driven half of the kilometers I'm supposed to. I just spoke to a local who said I have at least two hours left. Uh, not super smart, considering how tired I am and hungry, but uh, it is how it is. I had a good day. It did end up costing me a GoPro because the GoPro on my back, it um, yeah, it fell off. So expensive day on the road. It's really really bad, mostly because. I lost a ton of good footage, but yeah, it is how it is. But I gotta say, I have missed riding in the afternoons, seeing views like this. The sky is pink and blue, I have the view over the mountains, and just jungle, it's so beautiful, I cannot believe it. This is the most beautiful experience I've had in Kalimantan yet. Hopefully you can catch the colors that's in my side mirror right now because that is unbelievable. I am ready to arrive. Oh. <laughs> okay, he said two more minutes and I'm there. Yes, asphalt, asphalt, asphalt. Yes, we got tarmac, thank God. No, it's not tarmac, God damn it. I had finally arrived at the city of Badao after a very, very long night. And I had luckily found a great place to stay. And in the morning, I thought I would just go and check how much I looked like after last night. He has never been this dirty before, guys. What? <laughs> Time for you to get a shower, Machan. Badao is a border city where you can cross from Indonesia directly into Malaysia. And my plan was actually to do a quick ride into Malaysia, but unfortunately, at this station, you're not allowed to bring a motorcycle across the border. At least that's what they told me, but I definitely had to go and check it out anyway. Hey guys. Hello. Hey, you could. <laughs> Alright guys, so right now I'm in Badao and that, my friends, are Indonesia. And you see this on the other side of this tarmac is Malaysia, yeah? So, my first time in Malaysia. See yeah? Hey! <laughs> in Malaysia! Ah, back to Indonesia. Lebih bagus sih. 
And that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And now, a quick preview from the next episode, where Machen and I continue deeper into West Kalimantan. In this episode, we're exploring Lake Sentaro. Oh. <laughs>